So I thought I'd do a brief tour of my RV today just in case anyone wants to give me any input on organization or anything like that. Um, so by the front door right now and this is my boot tray. I kick off my boots after I come in. Uh, this is a dog house. It's got a little organizer here so that I have my stuff near me when I'm driving. I usually tuck my sun visor over here when I'm not using it. Um, portable power inverter and solar charger are on the dog house as well as one of my tool batteries. Here I have my little sofa which I've covered with a blanket so it's easier to clean and uh, overhead cabinets. I'm not going to go through all the cabinets right now, just point out what's in them as I go. Um, just like a lot of spare fabric and appliances in here. Um, my fridge has a whiteboard on it. I'm not using my fridge right now because I don't have propane right now and the fridge has some issues. I gotta help it work through. Um, zooming over here to this side. Over here is my workbench with dog crates and uh, two of my dogs are outside right now and Rusty's in here freaking out. What's wrong buddy? What's wrong? Is it windy? Poor buddy. Anyways, um, I got my keys hanging over by the wall. Dog leashes are hanging under these towels here and um, plastic bags so I have them on hand to grab for you know toting stuff around in. Eventually the workbench is gonna have a solid plywood top on it. Right now I just have scrap wood on it so it's usable. Um, at some point when I am stopped at a Home Depot parking lot I'm going to go buy some plywood for the top. But this will work for now. I've got a tarp stuffed under here just for storage. Um, and then I have uh, dog leashes and collars that are not currently on uh, hanging on these little hooks here on the cabinets. Dog supplies in that one food in that one, spices and food in that one. Uh, right now I have this electrical box just over here but after I get the plywood top in I'm gonna run it probably permanently over to around here or so, I'm not sure yet. Sink, um, under the sink just so you know I have some bottled emergency waters that I keep three sealed waters here just in case my water pump goes out so my dogs don't like dehydrate while I'm fixing it. <coughs> and uh, of course you've seen this, my little water supplies stuff. This dish soap came with a rig. I don't really use it very often except for when I really need it. Um, checking my levels since I couldn't remember which was which. I labeled them. Ooh. Up here I have uh, like protein powder and potions and other madness tea going on. I have like various food supplies and dishes in these bins right now. Uh, over here is my bedroom got my dirty laundry closet over here. This closet needs a little help so I don't really keep much in it. There's a water leak that I have to fix soon. Um, I keep a couple of warm uh, coats over here hanging up and then I have my, my bathrobe so that if I have to jump out of bed um, and kill someone in the middle of the night I don't do it naked because I feel like that would probably be tried differently in court. Um, I have my kind of nicer clothes over here, like, you know, lingerie hanging up with my leather jacket. And I have my clothes in this closet. I really want to find a small shelving bin to go in here. I don't know if I want to keep this ironing board or not, because I haven't used an iron in like five years, so it kind of seems like dead space. Um, it's like socks and foot stuff in here. Up here, I have some little bins that I keep everything in. Um, these are pretty much empty right now. Under the bed, I'm, I don't really feel like lifting it up, but under the bed, there's a 
the water pump, access to the fresh water, and um, then I have just a few sundry things stored in there. This is my tent. I need to put my tent back under the bed. But uh, under the bed's mostly still empty. There's just a few hardware things under there right now. Here's my bathroom. My bathroom's really scary. You see my towel rack, but there aren't any clean towels right now, so there you go. Um, laundry bucket is stored in the shower when I'm not using it. Shower currently does not have a shower curtain, but that's okay, because I don't really shower here anyways. I try to shower in town. Um, the trash can over here on the counter. I'm going to fasten it down in place at some point. I keep some fresh water here by the sink since I don't like to run my water pump all the time. I've got my rubber hot water bottle stored by the side of the toilet so they won't clatter around. This, I just, this used to be over the water pump. I just threw it down here for storage for now. Um, this needs some help, but I'm not going to help it right now. I need a couple more of these clear bins to organize everything with. So let's, let's not think about that too much. I have a lot of ideas for this bathroom. This bathroom I've pretty much gotten planned out the way I want it, but I still open ideas. I'm planning on um, putting a warming towel rack, 12 volt towel rack up here instead of this crappy towel rack at some point. Um, that should be cool. This terrible light the old owner installed. Uh, it doesn't work unless you're on shore power and for some reason none of the power in here works I suspect that I probably will have to check all the wiring in here and redo it before I try to put power back in this area because I suspect that the power is probably not on here for a reason so that'll be a thing and um, there's a small leak in the skylight over here and some of the padding's warped so after I fix the leak, I may want to do something about this upholstery situation if I could find some nice carpeting to put up. But um, what I'm planning on doing is growing plants in here and hanging probably um, four plant baskets in here with aromatic herbs like peppermint and pennyroyal and maybe lavender, I'm not sure yet, so that I can have nice pretty smelling things in my bathroom all the time and if I want to have a nice hot shower I could throw some pretty fresh herbs down in the bottom and make it smell good um, or what have you. Plus the skylight's just going to be awesome for growing things. That reminds me, I forgot to say over here, right now I just have my dog food here because my tomatoes are outside, but um, my tomatoes just wedge in under here, and then I'm going to run some cords up to here so that the tomatoes have their own little trellis that I can flop them over on and clip them down on, and they can grow in the light here. So, yeah, that's my rig, at least the inside of it. Uh, if anyone has any storage ideas or anything, I am open to them.